I'll see you at the clinic, okay?
Let's talk about something? Want we'll to check something out? Yeah. Sure. Come on. Why don't you go? We welcome you to the 32nd annual Clinton County Corn Festival. We have a beautiful day here in well, we store. Many yeah. activities going on throughout the day. We will be announcing those. Also, we have uh, about any kind of food that you might want. We have the here uh, at the festival. So as you walk British around, uh, made we hope in you'll, uh, we'll, you'll find so what you're looking for. North and South. Uh, we'll try something to cash in on to the remind America. everyone of that. No pets are permitted in the show rifle. area of the Sports America, Festival this year. He's mainly by the no north. pets the south had them too. in the show area of the Corn Festival. I know some of the folks who are here with cameras. The war progressed on. The weapons became smaller. But still the same caliber. Uh, no pets are permitted this year in the show so of Arena Man Area. America. Um, coming up at 12 o'clock. All three weapons are 58 calories. Uh, All three can shoot the same exact round. So if they uh, we British Enfield guy came across a dead Springfield, he could use his rounds. And same with vice versa. If the Springfield guy came across a dead infield, he could use his rounds. So on. Children's Corners activity in the special yeah. events area at noon. The way these weapons were loaded, the quilting demonstration, soldier busting, I have his cartridge no box. what that is, but you could have if his you're rounds. a cool person, you probably understand that. And, and his cat box. in Floral Hall. Coming up at 12.30, nail driving contest, ages 16 and over, men and women. Uh, that's in the special events area. And we have a group performing on the sound stage at 12.30, Signs of Salvation. So those are just some of the activities that are going on uh, this afternoon. Out here. And we'll keep you posted as the afternoon right. progresses. Now, the way the rifles were loaded, right, the soldier was reaching his cartridge box. You can watch them from over here. Pull out his round. Now, imagine this lead ball inside this paper tube like that. The rest of this is filled with black powder. Alright, you're out there on the battlefield. You're getting ready to fire. Alright, you grab your round. You got your rifle. Now, you had to have a special tool to help load your rifle. All right, you gotta get the powder out of here and into here. Daddy. How are you gonna do Daddy. it? Daddy. When you got both hands full. Just in the shade here. You're gonna use your teeth. If you didn't have your teeth in the front, you was either the cavalry or the artillery. If you had the front teeth, you got put in the infantry. What we're going to do is we're going to take it, we're going to rip it, that's where you need your teeth, pour the powder in. We're going to take our ramrods. We're going to ram paper and bullet down into the barrel. It all goes in the barrel. Pack it. Turn your ramrod. Are you ready to fire now? Not quite. You have to do one more thing. And sport your cap. All the cap looks like. Just like that. It's got a little bit of powder in it. You want to cock it. You want to put it on there like so. Now you're ready to shoot. Bang. This, this hammer's gonna fall, hit this cap. The cap's gonna let out a little pop noise. There's gonna be a little spark. The spark is gonna go inside the barrel, which ignites your powder and shoots the bullet out. Now, you had to do that three times, one minute. As war went on, the battle went on, as with any muzzle loader, it's gonna start getting fouled up on the inside. And it's going to get harder to put that 